Many people cope with pain on a daily basis, and for some, that pain can lead to addictions to the medications that provide temporary relief. But a new University of Florida study suggests doctors don't receive enough training on prescription drug abuse and addiction problems. UF researchers say new treatment programs must be developed to help manage a patient who is addicted to pain medication. Experts say a team approach involving different medical specialists could provide the key to treating people suffering from chronic pain and addiction. A multidisciplinary approach with addiction, pain, anesthesia, neurology, and psychiatry gives us the best chance to treat the pain syndrome. Experts say pain remains one of the most common reasons people seek medical care. Researchers say people who take pain medications for recent injuries face a real risk of addiction. Oftentimes for people who've had an accident or traumatic injury or uh, some pain syndrome, there is no stop. In that situation, it's very important to periodically evaluate yourself and to ask your physician to evaluate you to see if you still need that medicine. Prescription medication abuse has become the second leading cause of illegal drug abuse in the United States. At the University of Florida, I'm Chris Bilowich.